Uh, do you know which one's who? Welcome to the Velvet Room. Okay. This place exists between dream and reality. Okay, so we have Shadi on the left, and Lotter here on the right side. Why don't you introduce yourself? Not sure who these two players are uh, used. Oh, excuse me, my console is in Japanese. Well, the game's in Japanese. Uh, I wonder if he needs help. A little technical difficulties, as well as your alter ego. couldn't read what he was trying to input, despite uh, the button layout still being the same. Uh, it, it happens though, I mean, it's a different console. It's a foreign console, or a foreign game console, I guess, yeah. So anyways, on the left we have Minazuki against Junpei. Oh, there's a Junpei in this tournament. That's surprising. Oh, no. actually, <laughs> low tier here are fitting the character as well. Junpei is kind of low tier in this game. And we have a second Minazuki in, uh, right here. Nice jump in. Tries to get out, but gets counted hit out for his trouble. 5A whip swipe. Gets in with sweep. Nice. Minazuki gets out of the corner, but puts Junpei in the corner now. Okay, I don't think that's a good DP. Tries to hit out, but comes in with a jump and doesn't follow up the combo. Okay. Junpei also with his new, uh, with his uh, different game mechanics. Is he about to get a run? He's, up. He's got one so far. Two. Each time the bat hits, he gets a, a he gets a player on the base. Once he gets to 10, he enters like a, a, a better Junpei. He becomes a better Junpei. And um, if the bat does not make contact or they block the bat, I'm pretty sure that's an out. I forget. It's been a while. I know if he whiffs, it's definitely an out. And we can also learn from the game. Start the round, Junpei whip, swing. Yeah, so yeah, Junpei's stuff is kind of like, it's basically just baseball. If you know how to play baseball, you can really keep up with what he's doing. I, for one, do not really play baseball, so that's why I don't, I forget a bit now, every now and then. But anyways, Mizuki throws the blade and takes one of the cards, whips DP, gets punished for a shovel, 1500, that's not bad. Puts him in Awakening. Okay. And just pressure with the one. <laughs> oh, here's the special mode I was talking about. Junpei is a better character now. Uh, in this mode, he also does gain some... He does have health re region. I mean, it just happened right now, and it's happening right now as we speak. It happens as he's covering too, so... Oh, we want more. Take two. Two one, one. Round three, the start of the round. He jumps in and back dashes out. Early burst from Minazuki. And oh yeah, uh, the special mode for Junpei does uh, carry over rounds, so that will give him an advantage in the start. JB counter hit. Oh, clean hit, clean hit, clean hit. Oh, drops on the fortune. Oh no! 
I think he could have followed that up. <laughs> I'm not, I forget. I, uh, maybe with Mirror he could have? Whoa, reversal air. Wait, I think he wanted to um, counter. Uh, dead angle. Teleport to the same side. Character's main full screen. Mizuki going in. Flying pressure. EX teleport, which is where he can. He can he's allowed to block in that one. Regular teleport, he's forced to come out swinging. Oh no, this is kind of bad. One more mix up. I'm surprised I haven't seen a command grab lately. Uh, this will not kill despite him losing health. Because it's off of a dead angle. To the anti. Oh no. Teleports out, but not. Uh, responds with the roll. Oh, this should be dead. Oh, he whips! No! Why? <laughs> Oh no, how unfortunate. Junpei had it. Junpei had it. Mizuki messed up. But then Junpei didn't punish properly. <laughs> oh, that was really unfortunate for it. For low tier hero. The hero in, for... The hero of this tournament. <laughs> Tries a bunt the swords. He can bunt projectiles. He can actually hit projectiles with the bat as well. That's got the mention. And we have Junpei already knocked down the corner. Wakes up with the throw. That's a little bit a little bit of there from like guilty gear, you know, wake up the pretty strong option tagging. He bursts out, has been to the corner. But he didn't swap he should have swapped side. I I think he should have swapped side. But he's still in the corner now. Because Mizuki chose to burst it out. Okay, finds a gap, he beats out. Teleport, nice block. Jump catches back out just to make sure he's safe. Strike, strike, ball. Oh, nice. Nice win. Is this gonna hit? Yeah, it's hit. Home run, he's getting three on the, on the mount. Plus the one on the. Uh, He's got, we got four. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay, Mizuki going in. Teleport out. Teleport in. If he teleports across him in the corner, he will still stay in the same side. Just relentless pressure. Block. Punish. He could have actually won more of that. Oh, Jupe's answered the, the god mode. He can actually just wait it out and gain his health back. But not that long. That's like 15 seconds left. Oh! He, he was correct on the anti air, but he was too early. That was really unfortunate. I wish you good luck. Dive kicks at the end. Whoa, air turn JP. Very well. Keeping Junpei in mid screen. Okay. Junpei trying to push him now. Bunt whips! Yeah, I think he could have got a 5A for his troubles. Tries to air turn back dash across him, but was ready with the DP. Minizuki lets him out of the corner again. Jubei now no longer has his burst, but he's still in the mode. So. Oh no. Clean hit. That's nice to air turn JB. AOE block! That's actually. Well, I for one have trouble blocking that because I'm not I'm still not used to it due to not fighting many Junpeis. So if it was me, I would have gotten hit. Use the EX teleport to bait out an anti or something for uh, a mash out. Because, like I said, with EX teleport, he keeps his movement options and you can uh, choose a block. That angle's out. Junpei. Like 5% and this should be it! Shoddy takes game. Alright, low tier hero getting sent to losers now. Oh, we continue, right? Uh, who's next? This guy is... The second match. Tectonics? 
So Shadi's staying, staying on the setup.